Officials say the little boy is in the hospital in critical condition. Fox 5's Eric Perry is live outside Clayton Police Headquarters. And Eric, you just saw the mom being put into a police car. Yeah, only our cameras were there. Good evening to you, Russ and Courtney. That six-year-old fighting for his life in the hospital, broken bones, blood clots to the lungs, and bleeding to the brain. Only our cameras were there. Take a look as that mother, Portia Wells, was taken into custody. Here's what we know. Clayton County Police say Wells' boyfriend, Napoleon Eights, accused the six-year-old of stealing money. Over the weekend, I'm told the boyfriend physically abused that child for days as his mother stood and watched. At one point, police say the boyfriend even told the mom to leave the room. So for days, I'm told, the boyfriend did nothing until that Sunday the boy fell unconscious and the mom decided to give him an ice bath trying to wake him up that was unsuccessful. However, Monday and Tuesday, ordinary days for this mother, she went to work. I'm told she went and got her nails done. Her uh, feet did as well, only to take him to the hospital yesterday. That's where Clayton County Police got that initial charge, uh, that call to that hospital. The two face charges of child abuse. The mom faces additional charges of lying to police. She initially said she knew nothing about it or she wasn't there, but that turned out not to be the case there. So the mom, when we asked her questions on that perp walk to that uh, uh, escorted to the police car there. She didn't answer any of our questions. I asked if she had any remorse or anything like that. I can tell you her nails look freshly done. Her feet look freshly done. They'll go with the handcuffs and the jumpsuit in the Clayton County Jail. Here's what we're working on tonight for 10 o'clock. We're digging deep into the boyfriend's background and what police say the message in all of this is. You'll want to join us for that tonight at 10. Unbelievable and heartbreaking story here in Clayton County. I'm Eric Perry, Fox 5 News. Wow, a lot of observations there. Eric, thanks.